हेलो वेलकम टू आदित्य डबल वन ट्रिपल टी यूट्यूब चैनल दिस वन इज आसूस एक्स ट्रिपल फाइव एल डी मदर बोर्ड ओके इन दिस मदर बोर्ड प्रॉब्लम इज वेन वी कनेक्ट अडेप्टर ओके एंड ट्राई टू स्विच ऑन इट्स नॉट गेटिंग ऑन ओके आई एम गॉन सो यू द वोल्टेज इज फर्स्ट what voltage is we are getting okay after connecting you can see 19 volt as dc jack okay you can see 19 volt is okay 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 now what we do we check the first mosfet input side you can see 19 volt is also at input side now we check the output side there is no voltage okay now we check the gate voltage of first mosfet it's also zero okay means first mosfet is unable to switch the voltage okay this is the n channel mosfet okay as we know n channel mosfet requires high voltage from the input okay so in this type of cases what we have to do okay let's follow the sequence now start tracing as we know this is the first mosfet of this board okay and this mosfet is unable to to switch the voltage okay and and its gate is directly connected to its battery ic and its battery ic number is bq735 okay as we know there is no schematic of asus motherboard only board view we can see okay so what we do we open the uh, pdf of this ic and follow the sequence of battery ic okay so i have already downloaded the pdf this is the pdf of bq24735 and pin uh, and it's 20 pin ic now let's follow the sequence of this ic pin number 20 is vcc pin number 16 is ldo reason okay and pin number 6 is ac detect pin number 5 ac okay then pin number 4 ac drive ac drive is connected to the gate of both mosfets okay so what we do we follow the sequence and check the voltage is one by one which one is coming and which one is missing Okay, now first we check its pin number twenty, VCC is coming or not. At pin number twenty, you can see nineteen volt. Okay, okay. Now it's uh, pin number sixteen, five, ten, fifteen, sixteen. LDO reason. Uh, this one also okay, six point zero six. Okay. Now what we do? We check uh, its AC detect pin number six. this one is ac detect you can see 2.82 it's sufficient okay 2.82 it's sufficient now what we check ac okay uh pin number 5 ac okay zero it's missing okay in this board i have already changed a new battery ic but my problem is not solved okay in this board problem is uh, i'm going to show you the board view first okay 
this is the board view okay this is the board view okay of this motherboard okay and this one is the battery ic this one is the battery ic okay in this motherboard after searching i found the problem and the problem is acn and acp signal both are not properly connected through a clr okay when we search this signal in board view pin number 1 and pin number 2 i am going to show you uh, so the set okay oh sorry it's pin number uh, 15 i have selected okay uh, pin number 1 this one is the pin number 1 okay acn and acp okay uh, set it okay now little bit we need to zoom this okay uh remove you can see pin number 1 is connected to a capacitor okay so you the part number this is the capacitor okay and capacitor number PC double eight double one, and through one more capacitor PC double eight double zero, and it's connected to the CLR of this motherboard. I'm gonna show you. You can see in the board view. This is the CLR of this board. Okay, AC bad system pin one, PJ eight zero zero eight eight zero three and. 8804 okay this is the clr i am going to show you in the board this is the uh, uh, its continuity okay first acn first one is acn and second one is acp okay this one okay you can see pin number 1 and pin number 2 there is no continuity for working condition it should be zero having continuity okay having continuity mm. so i am going to show you from the clr this is the clr of pj8804 and pj8803 okay so what we do we connect uh, probe on pin number 1 okay then we check the continuity uh, you can see no continuity okay no continuity it's not beeping okay now i'm going to show you the from pin number 2 okay to the clr you can see continuity is available okay you can see the continuity is available okay when i searched in the board properly and i found that this track this is the acn line okay is little bit damaged you can see i'm going to show you the continuity from here this continuity okay but from the other side having no continuity okay having no continuity so what we do we join this line
now check the continuity on this track probably or not Then now I'm gonna show you on the battery IC. Okay. Pin number one two CLR and pin number two two CLR. It's also okay on both sides. Now I'm gonna show you the continuity on this PF. You can see the continuity 0 3 ok its continuity is ok let's uh, clean this IC little bit ok now check the board gate voltage is ok or not or motherboard is switching or not properly Okay. Now connect adapter. You can see the voltage at output side 18.95 and the gate voltage 23.83. And you can see on the DC supply it's taking ampere. Well I'm ready on. Now let's check the display. Now let's check the display. Checking ampere, good ampere, 52, 53, 54, oh, display is okay, okay, thank you.